Welcome to Lenore Tech Training Videos. In this video, we're going to teach you how to upgrade your software on your Lenore Tech device. The first thing you must do is download the programs to do so, discover and the bootloader. We have a separate video explaining how to download the discover program. For this video, I'll just go over downloading the bootloader. Just click the green download button. Open the program. Once you've downloaded the bootloader, you need to extract it as it comes as a zip folder. So just go ahead and extract. Once the bootloader is extracted, you can open it up. Now that we have the bootloader program, we need the cry file to update the software for the Lenore Tech device. Now that you've downloaded the bootloader, you'll need to go hover over downloads and click the software update and choose the software that corresponds to your device. For this example, I'm using the standard Netbell. So I'll go ahead and download the cry file and the web pages for the device. Now that we have all the programs we need, the bootloader and discover program, we'll start with the bootloader and update the cry file first. You can see I've already chose the cry file from the file menu. And to start, we'll click the capture target button. Now, once we click the capture target button, we need to restart the device. I'll do that now. Now you see that it did not capture the netbell whenever I restarted it. In this scenario, I'll need to turn off my firewall and I'll go ahead and do that now. Now that I've turned off my firewall, I'll click the capture target again and restart the device. And it captured it right away. Now that we've already have the cry file in the file menu, we can click program. And this takes around 30 seconds. After the programming is complete, you'll get this message appearing. From here, you need to reset, which just restarts the netbell. We can go over to the discoverer and upload the web pages, which is the bin file that you download from our website. Make sure you check the upload web pages checkbox. Then go ahead and click on the device. And this will bring you to a web page where you can choose the bin file, which is right here. And then go ahead and upload to the Netbell. Once it's done, you'll get a link leading to the main page of the device. And from here, you can go ahead and log in which the default login is admin admin.